Okay. I'll go with that. Yeah, well, yeah, okay, good, okay. The clock there underneath the camera. Yeah, so that was a kick Boom. save is what they and call that. And it's set by Atomic Time. Yeah, it, it is. was last atomic. night, too. Yeah, don't get that. too close to it. It might blow up. <laughs> yeah. Right on the car guy here from Westside Auto Pros. And we were just talking before the cameras went on. You could not have scripted a better topic for today's discussion. Am I on it or why? You are right on top <laughs> of it, my friend. Like, I, a, like a pad of butter on top of a stack of pancakes mm. on National Pancake Day. There it is. That is today as well. But anyway, is someone bringing pancakes in? I, I sure know. hope we, they we, will. We've been. We try to get the morning. sales department to, to try to uh, rattle some cages. I'll text Ted I'll, when we're done here. Okay. He'll get right on. The problem on. is they're all still sleeping. <laughs> Probably. But we are talking about seeing through your windshield, we which are. is kind of important. It's a little bit important. Um, it was a, a little tricky this morning because you know even uh, when you run like the the windshield washer fluid on there. It's, it's just cold enough, or maybe I just have cheap windshield washer fluid, but it would kind of frost or haze over a little bit too. Mm -hmm. Just we're, we're in that transition period. So um, yeah, we're gonna talk about uh, some important things, you know, keeping your, your windshield clean and, and visibility. And uh, a couple of things that I wanted to talk about was uh, first off, wiper blades, which uh, hopefully your car has these. Mm -hmm. um, if not, you probably need to get some. <laughs> uh, but but there's, there is a big, uh, a big quality difference on uh, wiper blades and one of the things I, I suggest people do when they look for wiper blades is, is the actual carrier part here. Um, look for one that's made out of metal. Mm -hmm. um, there, there's a lot of brands out there where these are now made out of plastic and mm -hmm. stuff and, and they they just don't seem to hold up as well and, and, and they don't weigh as much. I mean part of that the weight of this metal carrier uh, keeps the the wiper blade pushed down up against the the window as well as the, sure. the little pivots and the rivets and stuff so uh, I recommend that, that you replace it with with a metal one um, and I also recommend because it isn't that much more money instead of just buying the the rubber inserts that go in there to, to buy the whole unit because by the time the rubbers wore out um, so are the the little pivot pieces and and what what, what actually makes it work um, and, and again, it's not a lot of extra money, so j just buy the whole how much, thing. How much extra are we talking? You know, the we're, we're probably talking like another five to eight bucks for a pair. It's not worth it. No, no, I mean, it's, it's less than a medium pizza a month, and, and you're gonna buy wiper blades, you know, once or twice a year, but um, uh, just get, get the good stuff. It, it makes all the difference. They'll last a little bit longer, they'll clean better. Mm -hmm. um, the other thing uh, that, that's interesting, um, and this has happened to me, is, is you'll put new wiper blades on a car and all of a sudden it's like, you know, hey, these wiper blades aren't any good because they streak. Right. Brand new, out of the box, the things streak. And, and what we have found is uh, it, it isn't a defect in the wiper blade or it isn't that it's a bad wiper blade, uh, but what it ends up being is the, the rubber on the wiper blade sometimes has a coating on it from when it's manufactured and it isn't clean. Uh -huh. Is that and the release coating for the for the mold? Exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, engineering talk here now. Okay. My brother-in-law would be proud. Uh, but but anyway, uh, so that needs to be cleaned off. The windshield needs to be cleaned too. Take some glass cleaner, Windex, aerosol glass cleaner, something like that. Clean the windshield when you put your wiper blades on. But I also clean the edge of the wiper blade. And they used to come with, and, and, and most of them don't anymore because nobody used it, but they used to come with a little alcohol wipe in the package. Mm -hmm. And oh. that was there to take and clean the rubber edge of the blade before you put it on. Okay. Now you have to come up with your own. Um, I suggest like Kentucky Fried Chicken because no purchase is necessary. You just walk in, you grab some off of the, the little bin thing the little there. Nap, exactly, wet naps. exactly, yeah. yeah. But There's if you're hungry, go to Famous Dave's because they'll give you some as well. Uh -huh. But but just just use, or you could use, you know, isopropyl or or probably even glass cleaner. But just clean the edge of that wiper blade. Or so, a face pad maybe if you use face pads. Exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. Okay. So I don't use those. But but anyway, um, it, it'll work better. And and it isn't you know that it's a, a bad wiper blade. It's just stuff isn't clean. Okay. But again, um, you suggest the metal ones as absolutely. opposed to the plastic and ones. Okay. They, they, they just hold up a lot better. They, they, the plastic just isn't a, a good place All for All right, now right what now. about this time of year? You have this kind of wiper blade here. You can see it looks fairly normal. And then you have one here that's a little beefed up. Well, yeah. yep. actually, this is the arm that this hooks into. Oh, I was gonna say, mm, okay. what is that thing? Yeah, so, so then we have the whole assembly. Mm -hmm. And the reason I brought the arm. Is that from your truck? Uh, it is, it is, and, and it's the passenger side, so I don't have to put it back on when I go back to work. But the reason I brought the arm <laughs> is um, th there was a question that came in through AskRonTheCarGuy.com. It was Tammy from Grimes, and she said she had two or three sets of new wiper blades on her car, and they worked okay, but then when she'd get going down the highway, 
they didn't seem to, to clean as well on the highway speeds. Mm -hmm. okay. And and what we see, and, and so she kept trying new wiper blades, thinking, you know, these things aren't any good. Everybody blames the wiper blade. But what we actually see is the arms wear out over time. Okay. And there's a spring in here, right. and that spring gets weak. And if that spring's weak, it doesn't push the wiper blade up against the windshield right. as tight as it should. So around town it might be okay, but then when you get going down the road, right. you've got a weak spring, plus you got a little bit of a lift from, the, from wind the wind hitting the windshield, and all of a sudden the wiper blade's not contacting. So if, if you have a vehicle and, <clears> and <throat> at highway speeds they don't seem to work as well as they do in town, you know, take a look at the arms because you probably have a weak spring and, and you just buy the whole the whole arm assembly and put that on the vehicle. So. In, in case you don't want to buy the whole arm assembly, we had that same thing happen on, on our rig. There is a contraption you can get that's a... The spring. The, it's the spring yeah, itself. It gives yeah. an additional support to the spring, yep, and it yep. goes on in yep. two a seconds. Lot, a lot of truck stops have it. It hooks exactly. here, and then it pushes down and against it pushes, that. And it pushes it yeah, down. It's like a helper spring. And it could be a quick fix. Absolutely. Until you get them replaced. Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, and those actually do work. Mm -hmm. Yep, huh. absolutely. So, so, And then the last thing that I brought to share um, is this little gem. And, and we talk about this from time to time on the show. Uh, this is actually what uh, Aquapel looks like um, should you go buy it. And um, it doesn't look like much, but there's a, a little capsule of product in here and you squeeze it and it breaks and you put it on the windshield. And again, this stuff is totally amazing. Um, we've got up on the screen here, uh, it, it shows a, a car in the rain on the left side is the treated and the right side is the untreated side. Um, this is not a wax. There, there's some products out there uh, that, that are actually a wax like you put on your car and they fog over and, get and they don't work. They do, they get very hazy. Mm -hmm. and, and this is actually a polymer. It, it embeds itself into the glass and it'll last for up to four months. And, and it, it's just really cool. I mean, you get going you know, over 30, 35 miles an hour and it's raining and, and you might as well leave this off the vehicle because the stuff right. just it just sheens off. You've had it on your car. It before. really works very well. Yeah, it well. works real well, and it's really cool on a, on a day like today where you got that little bit of freezing right. going freezing on with it. Going on. Exactly, the the wipers will, will just take that right off because it, it, the the ice doesn't stick to the glass as tight as it does if you if you have no Aquapel on it. Now, how often would you need to do a treatment like that? Every three to four months. It depends on how often you wash your vehicle. I mean, and how and how much does it cost, Ron, the car guy? You know what? That is a great question, Lou. I'm glad you asked that. Thank you. Right now at Westside Auto Pros, we have a special Ooh. where you can get an Aquapel windshield treatment and two premium wiper blades with the metal carrier mm -hmm. installed on your vehicle for... 23 20, bucks! $23! I'm Excellent. so glad I'm not go. on Channel 8. <laughs> <laughs> I go so for eight eight. Bucks. <laughs> I always take advantage of this deal when it comes around. Yeah. It's, it's and you, you do, do have to replace your wipers more than once every couple years. Yeah, yeah, about yeah. once a year is typically what we see. The sun mm -hmm. and okay. stuff breaks them down. But yeah, you can get you can get two premium <laughs> wiper blades, an Aquapil windshield treatment. It's worth it. Yeah, uh, 23 it bucks. Yeah. Uh, there'll be a little tax on that. Um, but we're going to do that the whole month of March. Just call and ask for the, the KCWI Great Day Special. Um, call and talk to, to Joe or Heather, and we'll we'll get you hooked up on that. Perfect. Perfect. Take advantage of it, folks. Seriously, this stuff really does work, and you get wiper blades to boot. If people want to get in touch with you, Ron, how can they do it? Uh, they can go to our website, westsideautopros.com. Um, you can click on the link or the map to get there. You can call us on the phone. We're, we're pretty easily accessible. See that? When you get done uh, getting service at Westside Auto Pro, you'll say what we say here every week. Thanks, Ron, the car guy, and you'll <laughs> shake his hand. Shake his hand. That's right. Okay. Okay. There, there you go. go. Okay. And right. they have Cam in the love. Yeah.